being only small groups of people that think with their own minds and feel with their own heart. The majority of the people only walk and walk and not think so much about the consequences of their actions. Not think actually a lot. Not thinking about what their actions maybe can do in the long run. They don't think about the butterfly effects. Not can think what can my choices effect in the future? What can things would I choose affect somebody else? There being small groups that think with their own minds and feel with their own hearts. Most humans claim that they're being intelligent. Not showed, but they're told it. Most people say that they're being kind. And no, also, there's nothing shown it, but only say it. Walk a path, say this, do this. With a lot of double standards. I post in the dog food. First of all, and then go to McDonald's, Burger King, pay, pay other shoes you have to kill other animals. In the opinion, at least as smart as the dogs and cats. And then it been okay? No, it don't been okay. Because it matters over the victims. No matter if the victims being dogs, cats, pigs, turkeys, humans, mental retarded humans, no matter how the victim be, the oppressed group be, no single one want to be oppressed, torment, commodified, to an object. No, it's not what I want. They want to live the life the way they want to live it. Let anybody have to live by the rules of humans, because that's how humans can understand the world. And that's the way humans think the world have to be lived, because that is the way that I can understand it. The, the that's all the, also the way, also uh, with uh, all schools want to teach you, and, uh, society want to teach you, go to walk this path, not to walk that path, because that walk path is so strange and we don't know it, or something like that. Feel a thing with your own mind, and feel with your own hearts. Majority walks the path, that the media wants that they are one. Not thinking about the choices the consumer is. Not thinking about what it can do in the future. Not affect, not look how it affects the lives of others. The ones that don't live in their country and have not their privileges or rules or how you want to call it, which the youth is. 
Rules be not rules of not anybody you have to. Then being privileges. The only thing that you have is a bunch of temporary privileges. If you go to a land where they have not the privileges, you have not the privileges. I can take, I take, but away from you. Any two seconds, some children start from starvation. Not because there is too little food on the whole world. No, you can actually feed something like 800 humans with the food that we have at this moment on this planet. According to this study. But this, the reason the word there, that they are actually starve is because that people in the, world, in the first world uh, want to eat hamburgers and, uh, and cheese and other animal products that cost huge amount of food, huge amount of water and land. Actually, on the same uh, field where you can feed one meter, you can feed twelve. Vegans. So much land will it cost? It cost around something like two two thousand five hundred gallons of water. That's the amount of water that it will cost. It cost also around something like um, 90 pounds of grease. And around something like 5.5 feet of acre of, of um, rainforest. That's how much land it will cost. Imagine that the whole world becomes vegan. Did anybody give up their meat packages? That they realize that they're done being the most important thing on this planet. And they don't have to eat animal corpses. The things that come out of these animals. View how think with their own minds. And feel with your own hearts. Walk a path that the society wants that they walk. Not breaking away from that invisible bandage that we all seem to have on some society. Some great nationalism. Nationalism. Narcissism is a part of the society. Be so proud of the nation. Any miserable fool that have nothing to be proud of. Protect his nation. Protect all his foolish, all his flocks. All those infections. In order for us own insecurity. There's something that some will only do. But I have nothing to be proud of. And how say that once? Part your shield in the You don't have to be agree with 100% with somebody say. I think I'd be not 100% uh, uh, hit uh, with the views of uh, this man from the spot. But I have a lot of great ideas. Or not so great ideas, but realistic ideas. Actually. 
What make it justice actually? What make it justice? All the inch, all the double standards. Why it is not legal to kill and abuse humans? It is totally normal and acceptable to kill animals for hunting or for something like that. Even humans overpopulate without control. And if we put it away and put it the other way around, it is uh, actually the law supported when you shoot than deer and other animals. Is it not more logic oh, that we then also can sometimes justify if it, there being too much humans in society to kill humans? No, and therefore you don't have to do that and you have to sterilize some animals so that they don't become an overpopulation. That's the logical thing to do, not hunting. I'm thinking from barbarians, phonies and cronies, idiots and criminals. Just like, just like the military. Protecting old men's greedy and selfish. And unhonest get, get it. Uh, privileges and belongings. This is what war, war actually is. Old man's property be protected by young men how kill young children in poor countries. Greedy old man sent your young foolish children to other countries to murder young child children. <laughs> And then they get post stream uh, this order. Chill shock. <laughs> and all the horrible things that they find themselves in. <laughs> and then the question is um, although one extremely insane thing to me. So extremely insane always to me. Why it's not okay when some group do something out of your society wrong and you make then you make excuses for it. But when you've been in another society, you put a bomb to it. Where's the logic in that? View how think with her own mind and feel with her own heart. Most humans do what the media told them, not think out of the box, not come to a rational conclusion of their themselves. The first thing that I, young people have to learn this day, in this age, is to think, to learn to think for yourself, and then come to rational conclusions for yourself. If you go by to the habits, what somebody else think about something, and don't figure out this for yourself, you find out that other people let you hate the people that are doing the oppression, uh, hate the people that are being oppressed, and the animals are being oppressed, and love the victim if it suits their agenda. All true of the past to three stages. First, it'd be mad and ridicule. Second, it'd been violently opposed. And finally, it's been accepted as self evident And nobody questioned it. In the time of the slavery, around something like 100 million Native America has been murdered by written colonists, by conquistadors, um, by and by other Western people. Around something like 60 billion, uh, million, 60 million blacks have been murdered. Around something any year, something like 
150 billion animals be murdered. In the time of World War II, in the Third Reich, Nazis have murdered something like 6 billion Jews and 5 billion mentally retarded people um, and other kinds of people. So, what is the biggest AS uh, In the time of the slavery, also, was also euphemisms for um, harass, uh, for murdering black people because it was also not legal to kill that murder. In the time of Nazi, in the Nazis, they don't they say that they don't murder Jews. They say that they euphemize the Jews. Victimizers use always euphemisms to confuse the people and accept what they want. When the people that are in power want to create an image to justify something that is bad, they use the press, they use the press to create a humanitarian image for the devil, and they create a, use the press to create a devil image for humanitarian. That's the past. If you're not being careful, they let you hate with the newspaper. The people that's freeing and fighting for the liberation and let you love the people that are doing the oppression. Feel how things with your own minds. And feel with your own hearts. The animal liberation front being not terrorists. In the 14th year of the of no human being ever injured uh, by one animal liberation movement action. We have to stop with believing the lies that be spread by the corporations that abuse animals for a living. And elf animals, elf activists be not terrorists. How? Murder and torture animals for a living be terrorists. All the activists be not criminals. People that torturing and grossly profit from the torturing of animals being criminals. If the elf break laws and destroy the property of vivisectionists and slaughterhouse workers and farmers that have been just as the allied forces that break forever and destroy the cash chambers of Buchenhaus and Auschwitz and the slave liberationists that destroy the property of the white slave owners the white Christian cracker slave owners If the elf break laws, then so the Black Panthers have done. If the, uh, and actually also, a quote from Martin Luther King. It is a moral responsibility to disobey unjust laws. If the elf break break the if so if the uh, and white elf of, of liberation member of once of say if we been trespassing then so are the elf the allied forces that break down the cage of Birkenhaus and Auschwitz if we been tips then we been just as the elf lib as the if the uh, slave liberations that free the slave from the West. If we be vandals, the so are being the allied forces outbreak forever down the guest chambers of Buchenhaus and Auschwitz. So how being the real victims? And we how we been the real terrorists? If you think that we find will ever find a cure for cancer, 
by torturing monkeys in vivisection in unscientific vivisection experiments, you will then you will absolutely grossly delusional. This is not about the 99% of the of the DNA that matches by humans. This is about the one percent what make all the experiments totally a waste of the space and a waste of the experiments. You don't can do animal you don't will find any cure for any disease that you don't can find more cheaper and more and quicker if we use directly criminals like um, the vivisectionists or rapists or murderers or pedophiles or something like that I just say why are you always protecting victimizers instead of victims Something that is always so unpleasant for me. Why victimizers think always that they're being more special than the victims? Which kind of insane sociopath wants to protect a mass murderer? Which kind of insane psychopath wants to protect a child molester? Which kind of crazy freak, insane freak, wants to protect victims instead of vict or victimizers instead of victims? I choose always to try to victim in any situation. Use our minds. Feel how think with your own mind and live by the feelings of your own heart. If this word has been harsh and controversial to you, maybe it is not about what I said, but maybe it is. Because you understand what it actually means, but you don't want to accept it. Well, always any form of injustice, any form, have always the past the three stages. By some people, go it overnight, but other people will take a little bit look. But the most important thing is that you become and that you stop being living with your double standards. It would be not necessary. What it been in 99% of this actually awaken humanity. Awaken humanity. Peace begins on the dinner table, by what you eat on a daily basis. You don't can pray for peace and then do hypocritical violent things. That's not how the world works. Good people oppose discrimination by its roots, by speciesism. That don't engage in, in violent rituals that have been based on psychosis, on misconceptions, lies, and propaganda. Good people don't follow blindly what are being told, they think actually about it.
boundless compassion to any living being is the only guarantee of great moral conduct. How being full with this will, with absolute surety, not injure somebody else. Animals be not put, just on the same way that women be not punching bags and rape toys for, the, for disgusting men. Just like black people don't be slaves, only for the service of the white man. All living beings have their own reason for existence and does not to serve somebody else. Without their will. Awaken it. Awaken. Go vegan. There is no excuse for costing the least amount of harm possible on this planet. Make amends and move forward.